One thing I like to do is to use icons as cues for students and then reuse those cues um, so that they start to see, oh, if this, just like teachers use that learning target icon um, for different activities that they're frequently doing in class. It's a good visual reminder, just like you're using color to code things, you can go ahead and use icons as well. And there's a nice add-on in Google Slides for that. So if you go to the add-ons at the top, and if you go to slides and docs, and slides and docs has, this one has a little bit more that free ones than the noun project. So I'm just gonna pull one, um, and then good practice would be to just kind of keep them on a slide deck or keep them someplace where you can use them so that you're not constantly trying to find them. It's nice because you can also color code them. And if I change the size before I bring it in, it's just one less thing that I have to do. So anytime my students have to write something, um, I'm gonna use that as their cue. Yes, you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna write that response if there's something that I want them to submit. So now I have my icons. Um, I would maybe store these um, in a Google slide that you're gonna use, and then just kind of teach students how to use those. Oh, that's a written response. It will always have that. Um, this is another thing that you could potentially always incorporate into your master as well.